What are you waiting for, guys? Drop down in that description below, click that Discord link, and activate your seven-day free trial, and let the games begin. And before we get started here with today's video, if you're wondering what trading platform I am using, it is called Mumu. Remember, using my link in the description below will now grant you the perks that you see here on the screen. Also, guys, Mumu does allow trading during the complete pre and after market hours, which is a huge tool for us retail investors due to the fact that the pre and after market hours sometimes offer the best buying and selling opportunities. So here on Mumu and using my link in the description below, you get a lot to gain and nothing to lose. So with no further ado, let's dive right in. And don't forget to smash, smash that, that like button, button on, on your, your way in. R.I.G.L. gets major nine. Meanwhile, Mullen finally inks that ELMS deal, but why is it so important? Also, guys, RME, the upcoming merger, it looks great for that acquisition that it is targeting. So with no further ado, let's dive right in. What we came to talk about here first, guys, is R.I.G.L. And as you guys know, yesterday's aftermarket hours, trading did halt for rigl due to the pending news and when it came out it was very very great and that was the fda nod for the Lydia to treat acute myeloid leukemia which is huge guys now as you see here another leap up in price here in today's pre-market and i do believe that this is the type of news that can send a stock into a multi-running situation now if you're in this play give yourself a pat on the back you're in the right place to be but if you are eyeing this stock i would try to get in this play around 87 cents if you missed it guys oh well but i do believe that this stock has a great chance to see a dollar and 20 cents here on the day and we take a brief look and check out the short sale data that came into the play here yesterday not much guys not much anticipation at all because as you guys can see here the total trading volume is only 2.83 million and as you guys know here we're going to see much 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 more volume after getting that fda not an rig so be looking out for this thing to be one of those top gainers on the day next stock we're going to talk about here in today's video and that is r m e d catheter precisions which is planning to have a merger with r m e d by the end of q1 2023 said at least 800 procedures used vivo imaging in america which is its leading catheter imaging product guys and this is a major merging acquisition here for rmed guys and if we take a brief look and check out the day chart on this thing as you guys know we are sitting above the upper echelon on this upper canal area here on the bollinger indicator but what i want you guys to take a brief look at here is guys is yesterday's short sale analysis heavy heavy total short volume as you guys see here 2.35 million shares were sold short here yesterday and if we take a brief look and check out today's price action so far seeing this huge run up here in yesterday's aftermarket hours may have been shorts being forced covered or just hopping out before this merger hop goes down guys i do believe that this thing is going to start heating up here pretty soon as you guys know volume was extremely high off of that news and prayers and especially in comparison to what we were seeing here in the past as you guys see here on wednesday only 862,000 here 149,000 here on tuesday but thursday a big volume trading day and prepare to see even more volume here on today's trading for sure now 
Mullen stock, guys, for all you Mullinaires out there. Yesterday, Mullen completed the deal for ELMS in the assets that came with it. Now, a lot of people are wondering what was so special about buying out this bankrupt company. In case you guys don't know, this will speed up Mullen's production capability a ton. Mullen will now be able to get products on the road as early as Q1 2023 and 2023 Q3 guys will be the class three vehicles. So that is also a major move for Mullen. Like I said before, guys, Mullen biggest thing is getting its products on the road not only that guys they did acquire that facility in indiana for pennies on the dollar which was a old hummer facility and like i said before guys things are starting to shape up for a possible partnership with general motors a lot of people were thinking that partnership may have been amazon guys what if that fortune 500 company is general motors and the reason why i say general motors guys is because that deal that they did with rivian and ford is shaping up just like general motors and mullen going after two former executives of general motors also hiring one of those former former executives from tesla as well mullen is trying to capture as much market share in the ev industry as possible guys but 2023 is going to be a very 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 hot year for mullen stock we do have that reverse stock split ahead of us guys with the vote coming this month i know a lot of people are saying do not vote yes but if you ask me guys mullen really needs this reverse stock split no matter what we vote they're gonna pull it off either way so with that being said guys if you agree with anything i said in this video can you please leave a thumbs up on it also if you're new to the channel consider hitting that subscribe button and make sure you have all post notifications set to all so you will be alerted each and every time i create one of these videos and may the gangs be with